Hello and welcome to another video. I hope that you've been enjoying the London videos so far. Today we're going to meet a new friend in Soho for brunch, or lunch I guess, it's actually at one o'clock, so that's kind of not brunch anymore. Um, but I'm excited to meet her and I think it'll be really fun, so I'm gonna bring you along. Lunch was fun, and I really need to go home and do some work. But I figured I'd take a little bit of a diversion just to see some more stuff while I'm out, and I ended up here. I don't know why I find this so funny. Okay, now I am heading home to get some work done, and then I'm going to see James Bond again for the second time tonight with my flatmates because it was so good the first time. It was actually the first James Bond movie I've ever seen, and I'm seeing it twice, so pretty good. All right, well, I'll see you later today. Bye. I just got home, and I have two things to say. First of all, living in a city that has good public transportation is just so nice. I feel so free to go anywhere I want to, and I don't have to worry about, like, parking and all that kind of stuff. So that's good. Second thing is, I got a package. I'm about to FaceTime my mom to open this, but I did want to mention something because shipping boxes like this from the US can be pretty expensive. Um, so if you have a lot of stuff that you want to send, I would recommend send my bag, which is what I did to get my second suitcase over here. It was actually less expensive than sending a box and um, they did a really good job and everything got through customs and it wasn't like extra charges and all that kind of stuff. So I would recommend that if you do that. Um, this was just a little something extra my mom wanted to send me, but yeah, if you are having trouble finding a way to send your bag, use send my bag. <laughs> Today is a very exciting day because tonight I start a four week painting class, which I'm really excited about. I'm really excited to learn and hopefully it'll be like a fun way to just like get out, meet people, and just do something fun. So I'm very excited about it. I will let you know how it goes. Um, but that's this evening. I've already had a very busy day so far today. Um, I woke up and did laundry, which does not sound like a big deal, but when you live on the fourth floor of a building with no lift and there's only three washers and two dryers for the entire building, it's, everything has to be like very perfect as far as timing goes. So <laughs> excited that I got that out of the way. Um, I also went to, Waterstones, which is a bookstore, because I wanted to get a book to have in my bag to read on the train because obviously your phone doesn't work underground and just seemed like a good idea. So I got this book, it's called Hamnet, and I will let you know how it is. The lady at the till, the checkout lady, I, I'm like, I don't know if I should use British English or English or American English, but anyway, so yeah, anyway, the lady that was checking me out said that this was really, really good and it's the winner of the Women's Fiction prize for 2020 so I'm excited to read it and hopefully it'll be able to keep my attention with all of the stuff going on on the tube. Then I went on a walk through the park which is always a good time in my book and then I had to go run to the store because I had to get an apron for my painting class because I don't want to ruin my clothes but it is very clearly a cooking apron so hopefully that won't matter. All right I'm off to art class to look like an artist. <laughs> So fun. Already looking forward to next week. We didn't really have like a structure to this class. We were mostly just like figuring out where everybody was and like what we wanted to learn in the class. And then we did a still life oil painting. I'm excited because I feel like the tutor is very knowledgeable and like good at pulling things out of you. So I'm excited to see where it goes. <laughs> Hello from Highgate. I'm here. Um, I'm doing a tour of the cemetery later, but for now, I just got some tea. I'm usually not much of a tea drinker, but I figured I'd give it a try. We are in Highgate, as I mentioned, and I'm on my way to a beautiful lookout, which I'm very excited to see. Later, I have a cemetery tour. And then I'm also going to try and go to a pub or something while I'm here. And yeah, that's like, I just have a very basic plan, but we'll see where the day takes us. I 
just saw young Bill from Mamma Mia walking through the park and he was kind of looking at me funny and I was like, what's going on? And then I realized I had my camera like this. So he probably thought I was like stalking him or something. I don't know. But anyway, unfortunately I was not stalking him. So I did not, I wasn't recording. So missed that opportunity. I'm just walking through Waterloo Park now on my way to the pub, but the cemetery tour was so interesting. Like I would highly recommend if you can, um, if you come to London, first of all, go to Highgate, it's awesome. And second of all, do the cemetery tour because it's so interesting. And like, I did not think I would enjoy it as much as I did. So very happy with that. Now I'm off to the pub. Mm -hmm. 